Division of Fractions. Good day students, welcome back to my classroom. For today's lesson, you will learn how to divide fractions with or without regrouping. Let us begin. Let's try this first example. One third divided by two fifths. To divide fractions, first step is to get the reciprocal of the divisor or the second fraction but how are we going to get the reciprocal of a fraction hmm let's have a quick review to get the reciprocal of a fraction we just simply switch the position of the numerator and the denominator There. Now, the reciprocal of 2 fifths is 5 halves. Now, let us go back to our problem. Now, let's get the reciprocal of the divisor 2 fifths. There you go. The next step is, we need to change the operation to multiplication. And it's time to multiply the numerators and the denominators. 1 times 5 is 5. 3 times 2 is 6. Since our answer is already in its simplest form, this is now our final answer. Now let's have more example. Let's try 3 sevenths divided by three fifths again what is our first step you are right we need to get the reciprocal of the divisor three fifths let us switch the numerator and the denominator there now let's change division into multiplication now let us multiply the numerators and denominators. 3 times 5 is 15. 7 times 3 is 21. Is this our final answer? No, not yet. We can divide 15 and 21 by their greatest common factor, which is 3. 15 divided by 3 is 5 21 divided by 3 is 7 now this is our final answer now let us try 7 eighths divided by 4 sevenths again our first step is get the reciprocal of the divisor now let us change division to multiplication let's multiply 7 times 7 is 49 8 times 4 is 32 since our answer is an improper fraction we need to change this into a mixed number 49 divided by 32 1 1 times 32 is 32 49 minus 32 is 17 now our answer is 1 and 17 out of 32 next one how are we going to divide a fraction by a whole number this is just the same on how we multiply a fraction to a whole number first is we put 1 as the denominator of the whole number and then let us get the reciprocal of the divisor there now change division into multiplication 
let us multiply. 8 times 1 is 8. 9 times 4 is 36. Let us simplify our answer. 8 and 36 can be divided by their common factor 4. 8 divided by 4 is 2. 36 divided by 4 is 9. Now, 2 ninths is our final answer. Now, how are we going to divide a whole number by a fraction? Let us put 1 as the denominator of the whole number. Next, get the reciprocal of the divisor. Change division into multiplication. Let's multiply. 5 times 3 is 15. 1 times 1 is 1. Now let us simplify. Since the denominator of this fraction is 1, it will be equals to 15. Because 15 divided by 1 is 15. Now, how are we going to divide mixed numbers? First, change the mixed numbers into improper fractions. 2 times 2 is 4. Plus 1 is 5. Copy the denominator, 2. Next one, 4 times 1 is 4. Plus 1 is 5. Copy the denominator 4. Now, let us go and get the reciprocal of the divisor. Change division into multiplication. And let's multiply. 5 times 4 is 20. 2 times 5 is 10. Now let us simplify our answer. Since this is an improper fraction, let us divide them. 20 divided by 10 is 2. Now our answer is 2. Wonderful job students! Here are the things that you learned today. <laughs> 